Beware of illegal video cassettes. Check whether this video cassette carries a genuine security sticker. Video piracy is a crime. Do not accept it. Demand a genuine cassette from your video store. Poor quality illegal video cassettes reduce your viewing pleasure and jeopardize future film production. When in doubt, telephone the Federation Against Copyright Theft, FACT, on 081-568-6646. Touchstone Pictures presents the story of a little theater company headed for Broadway. Hold it! All they have to do is keep their line straight. Yes, we'll only just manage to fit it in. I mean, we'll only just do it. I mean... Their clothes off. Okay, I'll take it off. Yeah, here. And their hands off each other. Like a battlefield back there. There is something funny going on here. Inspired by the hit Broadway comedy... That was nominated for four Tony Awards oh! and hailed Best Comedy of the Year. What am I doing now? Noise is off. In everyone's life, there is a time that will always be remembered. How long is this kid staying? Not long. Don't expect me to entertain him. For a boy named Willard. Sit down and I'll make you a really nice lunch. That time is now. What are you listening to? Rap. Rap. And it details the common man's struggle for survival in a hostile environment. What? He's discovering what it means when two people drift apart. Can't make up my mind. Are you sick of me? Or are you just dead inside? And what it takes to bring them back together. How come you always do that? What? You get me think so hard. That's a good question. That's a very good question. They gave him a summer he'd never forget. Do you love them anymore? He gave them back the love they'd lost. Ben thinks you're beautiful. Melanie Griffith, Don Johnson, and Elijah Wood in Paradise. Runs the wrong squirrel up the right tree. Pardon me? Shirley Kenyon always had a way with words. You gotta just get out and honk your own horn. Radio station WNDY was looking for a way to boost their rating. I want someone with a PhD. This one's perfect. A doctor? A doctor, yeah. That's when Shirley walked in the wrong door. This must be our girl. Hello? You want me to go on the radio? And accidentally became Dr. Shirley Kendall. Hello, Dr. Shirley. Do I know you? said I was lazy. I want you to tell him that you're doing the very best you can. Then grab your ball and bag and get the hell out of the Hear me some straight talk, straight talk. This says Dr. Shirley here. The boss wants a doctor, so that's what you are. The hottest new personality in Chicago radio is forthright. Get down off the cross, honey. Somebody needs the wood. <laughs> She's funny. I'm bigger than a one-legged man in a butt-kicking contest. <laughs> She's Dr. Shirley. I don't think I'm going to feel comfortable lying about who I am. Captain Kangaroo. Wasn't really a captain. He wasn't even a kangaroo. She was the woman with all the answers. Anything goes, so let's not be shy. Until someone asked the wrong question. You're a doctor, huh? <laughs> what, uh, what kind of doctor are you? Well, where did you receive your training, if I may ask? Uh oh. Where did I receive my training? Uh oh. I'll tell you where I trained. Uh oh. Hey, screw you. <laughs> Dolly Parton, James Woods, in a modern day Cinderella story. Hey, it's Dr. Shirley. Thanks, Dr. Shirley. I'm just Shirley. Straight talk. Straight talk. Straight talk. We're gonna be alright. Recently, two high school students unearthed a prehistoric man in their own backyard. Ah! Their story is completely true. So great. 
it hurts. Wow, who's the guy with the dark squad? Is he fine or what? This guy's our ticket to fame and popularity. All we gotta do is get him enrolled in school, and he'll help us become popular. He's a looker. Wait, be careful! He's dope. I'd go out with him. Go on, guys. I'm too sexy for Milan. Too sexy for Milan. New York and Japan. <laughs> Today, buddy, we're gonna discuss the beverage. What are you doing, Mr. Stoney? We think you with a little juice. No, we think that you lose. No, we think that you Hollywood Pictures presents California Man. He's a million years old. Milk does the body good, huh? Great hair. And living proof that evolution is not an exact science. Oh, there's the wheel. Here comes fresh nugs. Wheezing the juice. Ow! Buddy. You got him talking like you now. It's <laughs> song. Step over to the office and get the bull whip. A whipping? That's all they get after what they've done? Get out of there! It was a matter of honor. They're paying a thousand dollars to whatever kills the two boys that cut up Delilah. In a time when lawmen were killers. What are y'all looking at? You English Bob. Outlaws were heroes. Well, I thought that you were dead. Hell, I even thought I was dead. Till I found out I was just in Nebraska. And a bad reputation. You're the one who killed William Harvey and robbed that train over Missouri. Was as good as gold. My guess is you're calling yourself Mr. William Money. Say what? You don't look no meaner than hell, cold-blooded damn killer. I ain't like that anymore, kid. Thousand dollars reward, Will. Nobody's gonna come. So you still have that Spencer rifle, huh? Yeah. He's my partner. If you don't go, I don't go. What's it come to three ways? Just because we're going on this killing, that don't mean I'm gonna go back to being the way I was. Are you really gonna kill them, cowboys? I do not like assassins. Or men of low character. We ain't bad men no more. We're farmers. There are a lot of savages! A bunch of bloody savages! Assassins! Well, I guess they have it coming. We all have it coming, can't they? Some legends will never be forgotten. Some wrongs can never be forgiven. The men don't want to get killed. Better clear on out the back. Unforgiven. I will survive. You have a gift, Mr. Riley. You are a natural kid. The power is still alive. Are you the boy I've been waiting for. I'm my own man, Mr. Horn. Hey, Oldman, you got some hammer, huh? The way you know people are saying, Jim, we love you. Jim, we are with you. Get him. It's illegal, Tommy. What goes on in that ring is a human cockfight. One, two, three! You baptize now! I'm talking two million bucks in your pocket. Be honest about it. You want the money, right? What do you want, Tommy? We're in this together. This is my ticket. I ain't gonna fight you. If you run out on this, you better keep on running. You fight when I say. You fight against who I say. He wants you to kill each other. It's time to make a choice. It's either you or him. Hey, we gotta fight or he don't pay. Hey. You don't say no to me, boy. Cuba Gooding Jr., star of Boys in the Hood. Carla Buono. John Slater. Introducing James Marshall. You see, Tommy, you're the boy I've been looking for. Gladiator. Nobody owns Tommy Riley. Nobody. I will survive. to Hollywood and meet the stars. Hi, Bert Griffin Mill. Oh, hi, Kevin. Nice to see you. 
Griffin Mill is a hotshot film producer. The Graduate, Part Two. It's out of Africa meets Pretty Woman. Who's the DA? Ah, no one. No one. No stars on this project. But Mr. Mill is not having a good day. Everybody, this is Mr. Mill. You remember him? He makes movies. Uh, Have a seat, uh, Mr. Mill. Where the fuck is he going? Excuse me, sir. Mr. Mill. Mr. Mill. This is not in here. This is my lieutenant. Oh, oh, sorry. Seat. The moment is devastating. Did you see where the tampons went that were in here? I would hate to get the wrong person arrested. Oh, please. This is Pasadena. We do not arrest the wrong person. That's L.A. This is a tough story. A tragedy. Find me. That's him. I, I swear on my mother's grave. Number three. May I have the person? Who the fuck is your mother, Barry? Yes. The player. Do places like this, baby. Really? Or maybe rallies. No stop. What took you so long? Traffic was a bitch. Can we talk about something other than Hollywood for a change? Yes. We're educated yeah. people. Whenever you rent or buy a video, you need to be sure that the film you choose is suitable for the audience at home. To help you, there are certificates given to films which tell you broadly what the film is like. This film has been classified 15, which means it's unsuitable for anyone younger than that. It's an offence for a shop to supply a 15 video to anyone below that age, so don't ask them to break the law. 15 films may have a fairly adult theme, or contain scenes of sex, violence or drugs, which, while not particularly graphic, are unsuitable for younger teenagers. They may also contain sexual swear words. Video certificates are there to give you the chance to make an informed choice. They allow you to have peace of mind and be entertained. Thanks for listening. Enjoy the film.